Hello dear students and English language teaching specialists. Welcome to the seventh lecture of our series of the book which is entitled The Semantic Web Trajectory in Enhancing English Language Development. This book is prepared to focus on using Web 3.0 for developing pre-service English language teachers' competencies and performance-based assessment. The title of this lecture is Improving Presentation Competencies for Pre-Service Teachers Through Semantic Web-Based. Let's warm up our minds by answering the following questions. 1. To what extent do you think the use of technology can enhance your presentation skills? 2. Do you think that performing presentation online is more comfortable and convenient than face-to-face -face one? Why? Now let's move on to the content of the lecture. Introduction This lecture focuses on presentation competency, clarifies its definition, emphasizes its importance for English language teachers, and highlights the benefits of utilizing semantic web-based programs. According to Ma and Yang, presentation competency is the ability to effectively communicate ideas, thoughts or messages to an audience verbally or through visual aids. As English language teachers, presentation competency is essential for delivering effective lessons and engaging with students. The use of semantic web-based programs can help improve presentation competency by providing tools and resources to create effective presentations. Utilizing semantic web-based programs in producing effective oral presentations. Utilizing semantic web-based programs can greatly benefit English language teachers in producing effective oral presentations. These programs offer numerous advantages over traditional presentation tools, such as Microsoft PowerPoint or Tone.ai by providing more engaging and interactive options for presenting information. One of the primary benefits of using semantic web-based programs is the ability to create visually appealing and engaging presentations. These programs offer more dynamic and creative options for presenting information, such as zooming in and out of content, incorporating animations and special effects, and using 3D graphics. This can help to capture students' attention and maintain their engagement throughout the presentation. In addition, these programs offer better organization and management of data. Teachers can easily categorize and arrange their content to present it in a logical and coherent manner. They can also use features like hyperlinks and multimedia resources to make their presentations more interactive and engaging. Another key advantage of using semantic web-based programs is the ability to easily share and collaborate on presentations. Teachers can share their presentations with colleagues and students through online platforms, such as Google Drive or OneDrive, allowing for greater collaboration and feedback. This also allows teachers to access their presentations from any device, providing greater flexibility and convenience. However, to utilize these programs effectively, English language teachers should understand their features and capabilities, select appropriate templates and layouts, and effectively incorporate multimedia resources. They should also ensure that their presentations are tailored to the level and needs of their students and that they remain focused and concise. The elements of oral presentation as an important skill for EFL teachers. Oral presentation skills are vital for English language teachers as they help convey information, facilitate discussion, and evaluate students' understanding of the material. Effective oral presentations can also help develop students' communication skills, critical thinking, and creativity. The key elements of an effective oral presentation for English language teachers are 1. Careful planning and preparation 2. Effective delivery skills 3. Time management 4. Handling questions effectively 5. Adaptability English language teachers must tailor their presentations to the level and needs of their students. They must also be aware of their body language, voice projection, and eye contact. Poor time management can lead to disengagement, while effective handling of questions can help clarify the message and engage students. Teachers must be prepared to adjust the presentation to meet students' needs and respond to unexpected situations. By possessing these skills, English language teachers can engage their students, convey information effectively, and facilitate discussions that promote critical thinking, creativity, and communication skills. Now we have reached the assessment. Part 1 – True or False Questions with Justification 
1. Presentation competency is an important skill for English language teachers. 2. Utilizing semantic web-based programs can improve presentation competency. 3. Creating engaging slides is not a best practice for effective presentations. 4. Time management is not an important consideration when planning and delivering presentations. 5. Utilizing storytelling techniques can help to create more engaging presentations. Part 2. Multiple Choice Questions 1. Which of the following is a benefit of utilizing semantic web-based programs for presentations? A. Limited customization options. B. Inability to collaborate with others. C. Ability to incorporate multimedia resources. D. Lack of online accessibility. 2. Which of the following is an element of effective presentations? A. Poor organization of content. B. Lack of visual aids. C. Ineffective delivery skills. D. Planning and preparation. 3. Which of the following is a best practice for creating engaging presentations? A. Using long paragraphs of text on slides. B. Avoiding interactive elements. C. Incorporating storytelling techniques. D. Using simple, monochromatic color schemes. 4. Which of the following is a delivery skill that is important for effective presentations? A. Avoiding eye contact with the audience. B. Speaking in a monotone voice. C. Using distracting hand gestures. D. Making eye contact with the audience. 5. Which of the following is a tip for utilizing semantic web-based programs effectively? A. Using long blocks of text on slides. B. B. Avoiding the use of multimedia resources. C. Choosing a simple, generic template. D. Creating effective visual aids. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it informative and enjoyable. If you liked what you saw, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel for more content like this. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an upload and as always feel free to leave a comment below with any questions or feedback. Until next time take care and stay tuned for more.